Welcome, Citadel. All right, there we go. And hi, Sky. <laughs> uh, okay, so where where are we at? Where are we at? Um, did I have not done this? Uh, need to find those. Uh, I still haven't found those. I don't think. Nope. We got Benning. I think some of these I can do after we do Sir Cash. Let's do Sir Cash. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I wrote what I think. It's a very good movie, but it was very first draft. But I made it the goal to get it done by the end of March, and I did manage that. It was exhausting, but I did it. And I really, really like it. And so it's out in the world and it will be revisited and probably improved, but I'm just happy I got it done. But then I had to sleep for like a week afterwards. <laughs> so it was like 95 pages uh, in a month. All right. Ooh. Mm, ammo's pretty good. Headshots are good, but like my guns can kind of handle those. All right. I think we're good. Nothing really else. Oh, thank you. Yeah, if not, I mean, I... Oh, this, this film, like, I'd wanted to write for a really, really long time. It's actually a historical drama. Um, <clears throat> and uh, it's, like, one of the few things I've written that I'm very desperate for it to get made. Hi, Jewel! Um, yes, Commander? I just... Yeah, like, I... Once I get it to a draft where I of feel course, better, I mean, like, I feel good about it now, but right now it was, like, the exercise to get it and just stamp it into the world. But now, once I edit it, like, I'm actually going to very seriously try to get it made. <laughs> you see the feeds from It's brutal. Amazing. Yeah. <laughs> it's our first draft song. But it's written. All right. Got any messages, Commander? I just got word. Excellent. We wouldn't have known about them if you hadn't caught the distress signal. Nice work. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Joel. Oh my gosh, yes. Having feedback is fabulous. Oh. Admiral Hackett forwarded this to me. I love these little snapshots of humanity. Hi, Alex. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Let me see. I think I'm going to do a quick run around since we just finished uh, Grissom Academy and all of that stuff. It wasn't a major one, but just in case. So Jack's an instructor? Just anyone who messes with biotic kids gets turned into a small stain on the floor and ceiling. Ooh, and that was Cerberus attacking the academy. <laughs> Man, that must have been like Christmas for her. It was, yeah, nice Joker. Getting them out of there. They were throwing out some impressive biotic power. Good. We could use some heavy hitters in the biotics department. It'll be good for them, too. Biotics face a lot of discrimination. Maybe if they save the galaxy, people will get over their issues. I didn't expect you to be sensitive about that. Hey, I'm just tired of stealing the spotlight from people with actual disabilities. I break ribs if I sneeze too hard. Being able to move crap with your mind is not a handicap. <laughs> Aw. Commander? Um, yeah, it's all about having people in your lives who, it's like the positive reinforcement, you know, that you're like, no, I, I'm not just doing this for me. I'm doing this for the people around me. And it helps a lot. Uh, okay, I don't think we have any priority things to do. I mean, should I go check in with my boyfriend? I'll go check in with my boyfriend. Because I can. <laughs> Hello? One of the worst parts of this war is watching the kids react. 
If they're lucky, they grow up thinking the galaxy is basically a decent place. <laughs> Some rough spots here. Oh, and that's there, so but for good, Sky. Life makes sense. Now they find out it was all a lie. They wake up to see these things in the dark that just want to destroy everyone they ever cared about. If they survive, <laughs> there'll be a lot of angry orphans out there looking for answers. Yes, indeed. Hi, Turquoise. <laughs> hmm. Life just wouldn't have been complete if I didn't see Jack one more time. It's nice to see. Looks like we beat Cerberus again. Do you think the elusive man fires lieutenants over failures like this, or just lines them up against the wall and gets it over with? The latter. Definitely the latter. I wish they had had a Grissom Academy for Turians when I was growing up. Always wanted to learn how to paint. Now I mostly paint walls with Reaper blood. Not the same, but it's a living. Fabulous. Another time. Always. All right. All right. Nope. Good to know. I had to readjust my sound levels after our Star Trek Sunday, and I not do not always get it right. So let me know how that sounds. No, thanks. Good looking out. Okay. Let's do it. Want to scan? Is there anything to scan? I don't think there's anything. Okay, let's do Sir Cash. Draw all of the Reapers <laughs> to the diplomatic meeting. It'll be fine. Commander, the Salarian Dalatras and Krogan clan chief are ready to come aboard. Have them brought to the conference room. And hope this doesn't start another war. Yeah, that. The Krogan is in no position to make demands. The Krogan has a name. Erd not Rex. And I'm not just some junkyard veteran. You unleash whenever you're in trouble. Okay. I've got my own I'll problems. It when I get a chance. Reaper scouts have arrived on Tuchunka. So why should I care if a few Tyrians go extinct? Trying to draw out negotiations will get you nowhere, Rex. I have no time for it. Just tell us what you want. I'll tell you what I need. A cure. For the genophage. Absolutely not. The genophage is non-negotiable. Why are you so opposed to the idea, Delatras? Because my people uplifted the Krogan. We know them best. You mean you used us to fight a war you couldn't win? It wasn't the Salarians or the Asari or even the Turians that stopped the Rachni. It was Krogan blood that turned the tide. And after that, you ceased to be useful. The genophage was the only way to keep your urges in check. Dalatrash, you may not like him, but Rex is right. Insulting him won't change that. I won't apologize for speaking voice. the truth. We uplifted the Krogan to do one thing, wage war. <laughs> right? It's all they know because it's all we wanted them to know. <laughs> it very much is. <laughs> Your people should have thought the matter through then. Was it really a surprise the Krogan revolted? That's precisely my point, Commander. We made a rash decision. We turned to the Krogan in desperation. It's the same mistake you're about to make today. No good can come from curing the genophage. The Krogan have paid for their mistakes. The genophage has gone on long enough. 1,476 years, if you're keeping track. It was a thousand years of peace, free from these 
brutes. Enough! Whether or not they deserve a cure is academic. It would take years to formulate one. My information says otherwise. <laughs> Grow good babies. <laughs> a Solarian scientist, Malin, grew a conscience. He was on my planet, testing a cure on our females. I remember. His methods were barbaric. But what you didn't know is that other females survived his experiments. So the Dalatress here sent in a team to clean up the whole mess and to take them prisoner. Where did you get this? It, it could be a fabrication. Don't insult me. Yeah, Those agreed. are my people. They're immune to the genophage, and you're going to give them back. Dalatras, is this true? Well, will curing the genophage benefit my people? How long do you think you'll last alone against the Reapers? Because if you don't help, that's how it'll end up. And I'll be the last friendly <laughs> Turian you ever see. It's a big. What's it gonna be? The females are being kept at one of our STG bases on Sirkash. But I warn you, Commander. The consequences of this will be felt for centuries to come. We're gonna be good. We're gonna be Let's good. Let's go get them. Your the finger was twitching. On Sir Kesh. This will take time. It happens now. As a council specter, Shepard can oversee the exchange. We're going. Oh, that's I awesome. I won't forget this, Commander. I want an alliance dress uniform. When he needs them most. Oh, by the way, everyone. I was listening to the Pod Directive episode today that came out today with John Hodgman. And he put out a call. <laughs> and it's really funny. It's about halfway through it. He put in a call. He was like, I wonder if there's anyone who could make me like accuse judge costume. Like, do you think that there are people out there? And like Tawny Newsom and Paul F. Tompkins bust out laughing. They're like, really you really don't think that there's someone that can do that out there so he literally like put out a call gave a contact info and was like if anyone can make q's uniform or q's uh, judge costume for me i would love that <laughs> jesus christ it was really 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 funny exchange okay let me try that volume we'll see the balance of dialogue to ambient but i think we should be all right i saw that that was so funny <laughs> I can't wait. I can't wait to see Jack Quaid with purple hair. Okay. Uh, oh, let me see. This is Sir Kesh. Who would be interesting to bring? I know. It was, and it amused them so much, too. It was really, really funny. I think I just, yeah, because I'm still just curious. Oh my god, I know, right? It's right after that. Which, like, I don't think... All the CBS people are going to be pretty tired. <laughs> That's a lot. To do the week-long cruise and then go do, like... They work at those things. That's going to be a lot. But it'll be fine. Okay. Um, I think we're good. We'll just roll with all this. Yeah, what did he have? I thought he had something good. Let's stick with a particle rifle. Try that. Why have I not bought the upgrades for these things? I should probably do that. Anyway, that's fine. Cranial trauma system. Awesome. Alright. <laughs> no worries, turquoise. Thank you. I'm only going to be here for probably about another hour, I think. I've got to get off around 1130. My partner's got a call he's got to do. All right. Yep. And he's definitely good with that. Ah, uh, that's why. Sorry. Getting back into it. I don't want everyone to have these things. I want some variety. Just 
I need to make a mental note to upgrade these. Cool. Sounds good. Enjoy your meeting. Good luck. <laughs> uh, and feel free to lurk as long as you need. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> yeah, I, I, yeah, fair. <laughs> Solarian homeworld we're headed to. They aren't used to seeing Krogan here, so let's keep it simple. Yeah, no. We land, oh, shit, get the females, and leave before anyone changes their mind. I still don't trust a word they say. <laughs> oh my gosh, that would be awesome, Turquoise. <laughs> Let diplomacy play out, Rex. You'll get what you want. These females are the best, and probably last hope for my people. We'll bring them home, Rex. You've waited long enough for this day. A lifetime. I appreciate the assist, Garrus. <laughs> Figured you'd gone soft sitting on They're your throne. They're friends Forgot now. Hold a gun. He wouldn't be king then, would he? Who's that? Oh He's yeah. We've got a guy. Sometimes with I'm us. not sure if the Normandy's a warship or a traveling freak show. <laughs> but as long as he can hold a gun. Commander, I have a Solarian base on sensors. Set her down. Commander, Solarian ground control has shown up to land. <laughs> Tell them the exactly. Delta authorized this herself. I knew they'd never keep their word. Let's see them try to stop a Krogan airdrop. Rex! <laughs> What's up? We have an unauthorized landing. And who authorized you to hold my race hostage? He's here to fight. <laughs> moments ago. I'd like to avoid a diplomatic incident. As would we. But you have something valuable to Rex. Something worth dying for. This matter can be resolved, but I must insist you remain under guard. <clears throat> Do I want to leave him? What happens if I say for else? I know. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Dr. <Dirkwitz. laughs> Yeah. And if we insist otherwise, you'll have another war on your hands. If anything goes wrong, and all bets are off. Those are. <laughs> no worries, those are just ID marks. It's a very immersive world. I'm Patrick Wicks, and I appreciate Also, welcome, Alex. That. Sorry, this is uh, Mass Effect 3, so we're kind of deep in the weeds of lore at this point, but it's essentially a movie from this point out, so you can just watch my storytelling. Careful! Watch <laughs> my the choose your own shield. adventure. Brings back memories. They were much smaller in my cycle. As you can see, this base contains sensitive information. Uh, yeah, no joke. What kind of work goes on here? Evolutionary trials, morphological simulations, exogenetic assessments. <laughs> yeah. Nothing is ever simple. It is. It's a dating simulator with some Science action. Science has always been our best defense. The research we do we here. We get very attached to these characters. Does that include studying lost Krogan? The females were in poor health when we found them on Tachanka. They were brought here to stabilize it their condition. It's a dating simulator. It gives me all the feels. <laughs> I'd like oh, to see. <laughs> of course, I'll need to clear you for the lower levels. Give me a few moments and meet me near the elevator. I love how close they were up on him as he's just like casually scrolling through. Okay, they've given us license to wander. Let's try not to get into too much trouble. This is where all you Solarians come from, huh? No wonder you're so <laughs> soft. Too busy writing poetry about waterfalls. <laughs> What? 
Shepard. <laughs> you all I are awesome. Like I should be the one going in. How about you stay you here know, and we only fight one war at a time? <laughs> I hate Tumor Boy. Good old fashioned it's Krogan fabulous. Hunter. If it had been real, they'd be dead. Idle threats are empty threats. <laughs> Maybe when this war is over, you can come <laughs> live on Tuchunka. You'd fit right in. All right. Do you want to, sh Sky? Do you want to share the April Fool's prank? <laughs> Who tipped you off about the females here? Well, I, I just got a Sorry, phone request Shepherd, too. But they're listening to every word we say. I prefer my Salarian liver served raw. <laughs> <laughs> Is correct. It was a delicacy in our cycle. Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachanka. Clans Jorgal and Ravenor sighted a few landing parties. The Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile of radioactive rubble, but it's our pile. And we'll fight the last Krogan to keep it that way. Radioactive. <laughs> <laughs> Garrus. I have to make friends with the one Turian in the galaxy who thinks he's funny. They're friends. Imagine how I. It's been such a I'm long supposed road. To hate Krogan, but you came along and warmed my heart with your winning personality. I could throw a few Solarians off a cliff if it'll make you feel better. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh crap! Did I already do the? Uh, sorry. What do you know about these females? They weren't fertile, so we used them. Oh, no worries, Andy. Hi. The ones who were. Yeah. <laughs> but Malin's experiments changed that. These damn piejacks stole them right out from under us. Are the Krogan ready to fight the Reapers? Ever since Sovereign oh, there you go. Up, Thank you. I figured this day would come. My people have spent too much time selling ourselves out as mercenaries. Now we can get back to doing what Krogan do best. Saving everyone else from giant monsters. Never going to let us forget about the Rachni Wars, are you? No. The last time I was at the Citadel, I didn't see a Turian statue in your honor. Ooh, <laughs> slam. Just wait till this war is over. Okay, I think we're okay. I might just go through Tachanka. Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachanka. Clans Jorgal okay, and Ravenor were sighted that. a few <laughs> landing parties. The Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile oh, of, yeah, no, that's right. of rubble, but it's our pile. Then we'll fight the last Krogan. I mean, it's adorable, so we'll watch it again. <laughs> Radioactive. <laughs> Garrus. I have to make Adorable. friends with the one Turian okay. in the galaxy um, who thinks I have a work funny. request I need to handle, Imagine and it's just going to take me like two minutes, Krogan, but, but it's an ASAP thing, so I'm going to go to be right back. Uh, feel free to chat as your heart's delight while I deal with this. Um, it's been good talking to you again, Share Rex. all of your dating sim stories. <laughs> I'm going to keep the stream live. Thank you, Sky. I appreciate it. I really, I shouldn't be too long, so I'll throw some music on, and I will be back shortly. Awesome. Thanks for understanding.
Okay, we're back. Hi, friends. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, I think we should all be good. Let me get the sound levels back up. Um, and here we go. So, I think I fixed it. I might need to pause again for a second, but I think we're good. I'll just keep an eye. Over in Intel? Told me the I mean, we can enjoy the longer. ambient dialogue in the meantime. The Reapers have them against the wall. The Turians have the biggest fleet in the galaxy. And we're only a few Mass Effect relays away from the whole mess. <gasps> hey! Commander Shepard, it's Major Kirihi. I'd heard you were coming. I remember you. Good to see you again. Sounds like you've been promoted. Yes, due in no small part to our mission on Vermeil. Hold the line. You saved my men that day. Good to see a friendly face, Major. Garrus Vicarian. Always a pleasure. It seems the oh my gosh, that's awesome, everyone. Together. Yay, vaccines. Although I'm pretty sure we're just going to have to implement a rule that anyone who got the one and done has to buy the first round of drinks when we start socializing again. I think that's just the rule that I made up, but that I'm going to stick to. <laughs> I'm still my second my second dose is in like three weeks, so three weeks? Yeah, about two and a half. <laughs> Thanks. I think it's a good rule. Are the Solarians prepared for war with the Reapers? I've heard what they're doing to your Earth. I'm not sure any species can prepare for that. Though rumors suggest you're building a super weapon of some kind. Uh, no comment. There were bro. rumors I was dead, too. You can't believe everything you hear. Oh, that's awesome, Except Sky. You were dead. Was I? <laughs> Just toying with him now. How'd you get posted to this base, Major? I led the team on Tachunka that found the females. Nasty business. Malin may have meant well, but his operation was crude. Test subjects were unaccounted for. The females easily escaped his lab. What do you think about bringing the female Krogan here? <laughs> Our I mean, that's fair, but it's also been a while. A lot of loyalties have shifted in the interim. I, when I was dead. Something valuable, they'll want to steal it. Either way, I have my orders. They'll be your problem soon enough. I guess we're both still feeling the effects of Burmire. Yes, ironic. You destroyed the genophage cure, yet now it's the key to an alliance. Your standoff with Erdnot Rex is legend within STG. Whoop, sorry. Drop my phone. I'm sure you saw Rex's entrance. Our colony's three systems away, saw it. Hey, Brad! I'm pleased with the reception. Can't say I blame him. Apologies, but better that. How's it going? With a shotgun wandering the base. Think of all the casualties. Our med pig couldn't handle it. I mean, yeah, Baka, it's true. And like, that's kind of the one thing that I love about getting the mRNA one is I'm just like new science, body transform, proteins do your thing. Um, I kind of like it. Makes me feel a little bit like superhero. Um, but yes, the one and done is fabulous. And hey, hey, Brad. Fabulous! We are all discussing our our vaccine Security sagas. Everyone here Expecting is in trouble? at least everyone in the chat is at some STG stage of it. <laughs> trouble. Failing that, create trouble for someone else. Our enemies have the same idea. A good principle to live by. Who's this? He's a friend. <laughs> Guess what? A Prothean. Prothean, of course. Amazing what they can do with genetic modification these days. Oh, sorry, so Alex. Tactic, Hopefully Commander. soon. Give the Reapers a good scare. And what are you really? Drell? Turian? Prothean. Oh. Oh. I see. Weird. Okay. Nice seeing you again, Major. Likewise. And Commander. Yeah, I saw that. That's regardless phenomenal. of what the politicians Go science. Decide, you can count on my support retaking Earth you do that consider it my way of returning a favor 
It would be an honor to fight alongside you again. Okay, well now that you said that, I'll tell you about our super weapon. I'm just not gonna come out with our very first sentence and be like, so yeah, we are. Way to confirm that. It's gotta Another earn the loyalty, man. Air defense okay. report I'm unidentified. Not quite ready yet. It's like someone's testing our defenses. Agree with them or not, our orders are clear. That's so cool, Baka. Who gave the order? This is a restricted area. At least stay back. But they're gonna kill That was a deft leap, Javik. I mean, that's also probably a fair assumption about Kurahe. That's so cool, Brad. Yeah, Alex, I was kind of the same way. Like, I, all of my work it's has been done at home. Um, but then it just reached the point where I was like, hey, they've got it out there. If you fall under the, you know, if you're in the current tier for wherever you're at, just go get it. Because the more people, the better. You're not, I think at this stage, it's like you're not taking anything away from people as long as, like, it's your tier. Um, but yeah, hopefully... We're all soon, but I get that feeling. This is a very long the month commander. between the two shots. If you get the two. without reenacting the Krogan rebellions. What do you think about handing over the Krogan? Yeah, I differ from most of my colleagues. I managed to get Hearing mine at CBS. We'll be closer to this issue. In the future, the Krogan may yet play oh, some nice role guy. we can't even yeah. imagine. We should let the Be interesting to see what school looks like next dies, fall. Not galactic politics. Thanks for your time. Of course. Proceed into the elevator when you're ready. Hi, Slappy. Oh man, that sucks. I don't like what I'm hearing. What? There was an outbound comm traffic 20 minutes ago from inside the base. And? A burst transmission, fully encoded, with no identity signature. No signature? That's against protocol. No, someone's passing a message. I've got a bad feeling about this. It's for our Star Wars fans. <laughs> I mean, vaccines are a requirement. Like, your sort of base down. kid Someone vaccines will... are requirements for lots of colleges. So I'm not too surprised. Yeah, uh... I felt the same, Baka. What's happening? Oh, sorry. Focus. <laughs> you all can chat. I need to focus. <laughs> Sensors have picked up activity on the perimeter. Hurry, Commander. Someone will meet you below. Okay, Rex, can we get my buddy out of there? Whatever. All specimens are accounted for, sir. Shepard, excellent timing. Good to have you here. Morden? Eyesight's still sharp. Surprise, understandable. Hadn't expected to return to work. You're back with STG. Special consultant. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. <laughs> Helped female Krogan. Said information Did anyone else's stomach Encourage drop when he said that? <laughs> you must be Rex's inside source. Yes, can explain later. Security warnings not yeah. normal. Need to get off world for sake of Krogan. Females had weakened immune systems. Side effect of Malin's cure. These didn't survive. But what about Malin's research? I thought we saved it. Indeed, data saved, but not complete. Ooh. Lacks crucial details to reconstruct cure. But still useful for synthesizing from living tissue. I need tissue. to finish my armor. Couldn't save them. I'm sure you did everything you could, Morton. Arrived too late. Cannot delay now. One survivor, immune to genophage, can synthesize cure from her tissue. She's still here. Yes, last hope for Krogan. If she dies, genophage cure... Problematic. Please be careful. Krogan slow to trust. Oh. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we, we are. <laughs> it is topical. That serve no tactical purpose. Erdnot Rex and I are here to take you home. 
why? What am I to you? Yeah, I think I've hit that, like, um, maybe it's because we're all getting vaccinated or because it's, like, spring now that I'm feeling that urge to, like, work out again, get my projects finished, the stuff, like, a year ago. I was like, awesome, I'm gonna use all this time to, like, take care of stuff in my life, and then a year passes. <laughs> but we got this team. Do your thing. Those are my sisters you saw back there. They died in a lot of pain. Did the best we could. And now I know I'm the only one left. That makes me dangerous to a lot of people. What about you, Commander Shepard? Why are you here? You're the future of the Krogan race. I'm fighting for that. Then I hope you brought an army. There go. Give me an update. Outbound communications have been severed. We're cut off. Secure all data to off-site location. What's happening? We have multiple ships inbound. It's a red thingy moving toward the green thingy. I think Shepard, we're the green the thingy. Shepard's troops are attacking the base. Get the females out of there now. Only one survived, Rex. It might be safer down here. What? So the Solarians can kill her like the others? Release the female. We're leaving. I can't. Protocol states during lockdown, no specimens. Objection noted. Now, please release Krogan. Need to monitor pod as it appears quarantine procedures. <laughs> Meet us at next checkpoint, Shepard. Likely Cerberus opposes Genophage cure. Oh, yeah. You'll see Tachanka again, I promise. Get your elevator, Shepard. <laughs> Thanks, guy. I'll try to make life miserable for Cerberus. This looks worse than I thought. Oh, yeah, this is not good. This is why we buy that mod. More incoming. All squads, be advised for countering resistance. Don't let them take cover in the lab. Crap, I always get lost here. I always get lost here. Easy to say okay. until you've had to fight a yog face to face. Oh my god, the amount of I just had a horrible flashback. Oh crap. Careful. There goes the next shadow broker. <laughs> Could have sworn he was muttering to Sony the whole time. You got Oh yeah, how do I run? Oh, can't run. Ah! <laughs> oh. I 
just remember being so lost here. That kneecap shot. I know, I know, I know. Are you okay? Containment shield is holding. We'll try to repair if necessary. Can't speak for Krogan's health, however. I'm fine, Commander. <laughs> Females kept secret. Possibly a mole in STG could be indoctrinated. If no Krogan alliance with Turians, Reapers left unchallenged. We'll do more than challenge them. Shepard, meet us at next checkpoint. Server is likely to target. Hurry, next checkpoint! One boo. Go, Commander. I'll cover you. <laughs> Your orders on a hold position and we'll the next checkpoint. Nothing. You can try to scare me. Looks like Surfer has got some help. Head to head will get us straight up, Captain. We may be able to flank them. All right, we can try flanking them. We have sure. to take out those turrets. I know. I won't. Good. Nice. Dead. To the next checkpoint. I'm sure Cerberus is in time. This way? 
Or is it upstairs and then that way? It's upstairs and then that way. Thank you. It's very scary. <laughs> I know, so rude. Strong, but not designed for direct fire. This isn't your I am alive. Also, I do have the lurk command. I'd like to. Hang in there. Oh, Avalanche Creations. Hi. Welcome. Just the landing area. Hope Erd not Rex still waiting. Rex can't keep his hands off a fertile female. Can the lurk be command better. is just for people to play with. I'll see you up top. <laughs> it's nothing fancy. We found the Krogan. Yeah. Let's get the hell out of here. Shepard, get your ass up here. I can't fly around forever. The female's on the way up to the landing area. You pull this off, and I'm making you an honorary Krogan. I'm already an honorary Krogan, man. Also, shit, I don't know where to go. Alright. Not there. I don't think it's there. Is it up there? I think it might be up there. Oh, hi, Asher. <laughs> Someone tell me where to go. Is it just back this way? It's just back this way. They I fooled me. There. Thanks. <laughs> That's funny, Rooster. Also, hello. I got you. I got you. Shepard, you must authorize release. Pod then transfers to loading area. Let's get out of there. Nope. 
<laughs> it looks so cool, though. Oh. Uh oh. Alright, boys, you know what to do. You know what to do. This isn't our first, it won't be our last. Stressful. Why is this so stressful? Just let me at it. All right. Come on, boys. Uh, it's got shields. Should probably just do adrenaline rush. Talking me, Rex. Got it, got it, got it. Rex hasn't exactly mellowed the day, has he? <laughs> no, he yeah, is not. Watch out. We still got Cerberus troopers left. <laughs> Teamwork. Shepard, I think you did it. Looks clear from here. I'm oh, man. You can't see it under that chat, but that pot integrity was not doing great. <laughs> I mean, I know they do that intentionally, but yeah, Brad, the soundtrack is so good! Why does it make us hurt so? Rex? You had me worried there for a minute. Let's make this quick! Let's get you out of there. Yes! Dave, hi! I can handle myself, Rex. Women. <laughs> Exactly, Jive. We love it. Commander, I'm hearing chatter you're brokering a treaty between the Krogan and the Turians. If I get Krogan boots on Palavin, the Turians promise me their support. And how does Cerberus get involved? I don't know. The elusive man is up to something. Then keep them at bay. I can't overstate what a victory this treaty would be for the Alliance. We'll need all the help we can get. How's the Prothean device coming? Alliance R&D has officially begun construction. The team has dubbed it Project Crucible. We're throwing everybody who knows how to hold a hammer at it. This is going to be the most ambitious undertaking in human history. Will we get it done? I'm not saying it won't be a challenge, but our researchers tell me the designs are elegant, massive in scope. But strangely simple as well. We can do this, Shepard. You can do this. Never doubt that. No, sir. Good. Hack it out. Never. I love my Admiral boyfriend. <laughs> <G> yeah. <laughs> 
Agreed. We were all just talking about our various vaccinated states. You have the female. And that's okay. I'm putting the, the video up on YouTube later. after the stream. That wasn't the deal. The Palavin needs your reinforcements now. We can't delay. Unless every Krogan gets the cure, there's no alliance. Morden, how long will it take to finish a cure? Need to synthesize base antigen from female. Also requires healthy male Krogan tissue. We'll need a sample. You're looking at it. Acceptable. We'll need you to remain aboard Normandy for a procedure. Uh, let's hope the food's gotten better. <laughs> Formulating a cure that works for Evelyn <sighs> Krogan sounds like a tall order, Morton. Can you do it? Of course. Similar to a genophage modification project. Working against own alterations this time. Not as simple as garbage DNA blocking attachment sites. <laughs> we'll need to counteract shutdown of redundant nervous system, adjust neurotransmitter levels. Got it. We'll create cure, Shepard. Don't need to worry. Then get started, Morton, and make it quick. Always do. We'll be in Med Bay if you'd like to speak more. Eve requires tests. Eve? Female's real name unknown. Normandy, a human vessel. Human mythology seemed appropriate under circumstances. Suggest so speaking with her. New perspective. Surprising in Krogan. Now, is there anything else? There's a small matter concerning a ship we've lost contact with. What happened? I'd rather discuss it in private. Oh, really? Turian problems can't even come close to what I've got. What is it? Some of my men went missing. The rest of it we can discuss somewhere else. <laughs> I'll find you both in the war room. Just be ready to talk. We are done with your nonsense. All right. Um, let's do some talks. Rex. I'll have a show down there on Sir Cash, just like yeah. the old days, Shepherd. In open right rooms. down to me pulling your ass out of the fire. Like they think they're I not was listening. the one with bullets flying at me. And I gave you the moral support to dodge them. Uh-huh. You said one of your squads is missing. They were scouting out the Rachni relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. I've got Arlac Company, my best unit, on standby. You give the word, and I'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. What will you do after the genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Solarians. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I won't let them. That isn't Aww. our path forward. This time we'll be different. It's the leader we need. A lot of people will be relieved to hear that. No one wants to repeat history. They know we'd probably win this time. But war has never brought us anything except misery. It's time to focus on rebuilding. What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper forces arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tachanka. Not when we're about to cure the genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. Back on Sir Kesh, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. <laughs> then think about it. <sighs> then talk about it some more. Females. No offense. <laughs> Either or not, we sometimes have good ideas, Rex. You should try listening. Just saying. 
Yeah, but our women have so many of them. <laughs> so sometimes I pretend to have listen. You've learned nothing, Rex. Well, let's just say Krogan females have tempers too. <laughs> oh, we love you. All right. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever and destroy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I know. Same I was energy. There. <laughs> Got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni, but maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. That's it for now, Rex. All right. Let's get back to work. Anytime. And Shepard, I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. There were I still other don't have places. a window like Liara does, but it's progress. <laughs> Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? Amazing. Freaking love it. Commander. You right. said one of your ships had gone missing. Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Chuchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are you yeah, doing exactly. there? Yeah, exactly. I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital. Uh, we gotta work to together, man. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help and understanding. Your men that crashed onto Chanka, how many are there? A platoon. You said their mission was a matter of galactic peace. We're gonna keep Why? poking. I'm sorry, Commander. As I said, it's highly classified. I've got ways. Look, if you want me to put my ass on the line, I need answers. I can't tell you. Please understand. The commander is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. He'll be your contact. Oh, the plot Victus. thickens. My son. I needed someone I could trust completely. I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch, but Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. It's worth checking in all the these. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it, it's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader. Yet your people will die if you he refuse. Does. <laughs> we find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. I know what the situation with Palavin is. It sucks. The Solarian Delatrus worries about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers. But I understand her doubts. Oh, no worries, young. Andy. I gotta get off That's soon anyway. I'm just gonna Krogan talk to people before they were that relentless. a Jedi's meeting. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons, directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. And I'm recording. I'm putting the these playthroughs on YouTube. Resort. Apparently so people yes. watch them. Krogan Which intentions after this war will be a serious concern, but I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. That's all. Of course, Commander. All right. Do you think Solarians would have a base on their homeworld secured better? Ooh. They were solid. Cerberus has Reaper tech. Compared to those upgrades, the Solarians might as well have been throwing rocks. The 
Ruben and the Turians really should get behind the Alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. <laughs> now that's about it. So, bringing the Krogan to a war summit went well. You want me to invite the Batarians too? Or the Vorja? <laughs> Building alliances is the only way we stand a chance against the Reapers. <laughs> yeah, but the Krogan? I'd feel better if we had a tighter plan, like time travel or teaching the Reapers to love. <laughs> Still, good to have Morden back. The bad guys shouldn't get the monopoly on mad scientists. Commander. It is good you came by. I have questions about the genophage. You and everyone else. What do you need, Edie? A Krogan female of breeding age can produce clutches of up to 1,000 fertilized eggs over the course of a year. There are over 1 billion females on Tachanka. If even 1% become fully fertile, they can birth 10 billion infants. That's the power Earth, of math, bugs people! Have a lot of young too. Most of them die. The attrition rate would naturally be high, but the state has an interest in keeping the children alive for warfare purposes. Any other cheerful thoughts? <laughs> Logistics. Even were they to side with us, transporting the Krogan to the battlefields of Palavin could prove difficult. They have been demilitarized. That is, they have no warships. What do you suggest? They will need Turian or civilian starships to carry them to battle. With your permission, I will make the necessary calls to have these ships in place for when you deliver the Krogan. Do it. Anything else? Food. They will be unable to eat anything on Palavin. They must bring their own, or rely on the nutrients in their humps. This keeps getting better and better. The Krogan will also <laughs> he really is. <laughs> since Krogan fight with others of their kind in enclosed spaces such as starships. Make it happen. Are there any last things you're worried about? Nothing that demands your attention, Shepard. You sure? <laughs> Fabulous. Alright. Here we go. Talk to alien space boyfriend, and then I'm gonna call it. But I'm thinking, don't have any meetings tomorrow. Commander, we've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Tachanka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. Got it. Um, I'm thinking same time tomorrow ish. I'll hop on. Keep an eye out on the Discord and the like as usual. Shepard, they say female Krogan have a thing for guys with scars. So I've heard. I've got a few myself. Here's hoping nobody <laughs> arranged marriage to cement this deal. Though I oh. have to say, I admire Eve. Oh, <laughs> Baka, why? With the genophage. <laughs> and now, to top it all off, she's her people's last hope. Imagine the pressure. It takes real No, Willow was still that. going through her own self. We can measure up. Understanding. I guess we're at war with Cerberus now, huh? We're always at war with Cerberus, bro. I've never actually seen a female Krogan. Seems like they're the real brains on Tichonka. Good to see Morden still alive and kicking, and <laughs> ways to cause trouble. Not right now. Yeah, but you say that in that breathy voice, it makes me want to keep coming back for more. Saying. Uh, all right. Let's go talk to Eve in medical. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. <laughs> loyal, reasonably intelligent. Aggressive. I mean, almost like Krogan. It works. <laughs> third time, Doctor. I'm not interested. Glad you all ah, put Shepard. up with me. We were just. Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. He's you in protective relax. mode. Can't be too careful. Or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? <laughs> kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. 
You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's release my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility. Her welfare, <laughs> a priority. How dare they? Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor. <laughs> Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. So... Back. <laughs> Common phobia. Fear of needles. <laughs> Poor Solarian doctors. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. The line, you've got a quad doctor, Maybe does refer it. to no, Krogan no, no, no. anatomy. <laughs> if anyone... What are you talking has about? Has looked that up before. The method to extract the truth cure without killing you. Many variables. Your immune system compromised. Consider yeah. the options. And you have to do it out loud? Yes. Auditory learner. Need to hear self think. Simulate conversation to promote new ideas. Maximize productivity. But you're talking about me dying. Oh, apologies. Medical details causing emotional distress. I hadn't considered effect on patient. No, it just means I can't sleep. Doing my best. <laughs> we'll avoid... Sensitive subjects. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. How'd you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. Would you go to Malin again? Absolutely. It only takes one candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom <laughs> comes from pain, and You're the welcome. genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan will flourish. How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. Ugh. How did you make it out alive? I started digging the wrong way. I was in complete darkness. Nothing other than my own heartbeat to sustain me. What happened? I found this. A simple crystal, but it became my chisel. Take it as a reminder, Commander. In the darkest hour, there is always a way out. What do you think of Rex? <laughs> when he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's <laughs> happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong She's leader. She's so good. I know in his heart, Rex wants what's best for us. Though not all the other yeah. clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And <laughs> that, you can tell him. <laughs> If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the genophage? Nose, that is I so nosy, Shepard. I bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a fresh mom would kill them and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. Jesus. What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath. That's when my Sorry, definitely began. should have content warning the that. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. 
There is nothing else. There is no reason to exist it's other good, than the hope that the next but... day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. How do you think things will change after the genophage yeah. is cured? Baca's Our species face. will find yeah. its balance again. <laughs> Females will help shape the future, like in the ancient days, before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. <laughs> Most seem hell-bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they've become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. Warden. Let's How's talk Warden about our favorite. You? Better than Krogan males do. He's not like a typical Salarian. <sighs> no, no, no. Organ redundancy results in new period before metaphase. I Can't I alter that. The Damage to telomeres, of... premature aging. He does that. <laughs> I sense pain in him, too. He told me about his work on the genophage. I should consider him an enemy. Yet I think seeing my sisters and I changed something in him. A sorry Borcha offspring have an allergy to dairy and a <laughs> Well, it wasn't his ear. <laughs> oh lord, I'm gonna cry so hard. Thanks for talking this to me. Stupid game. It's my pleasure, Commander. I'm glad to see humans treat their women with respect. Your people have placed a lot of responsibility on you. No more than your people <clears throat> put on you. <laughs> then maybe we can show the men how it's done. <laughs> Deal. Sisterhood. All right. On that note, that was intense. Um, I think we're going to end that here. I got to hop off. Reduce the bandwidth in the house. All right. Thank you, everyone. I know. Stupid roller coaster soap opera game <laughs> exactly um all right well thanks all for hanging out uh take care of yourselves i will try to be back here around the same time tomorrow uh again another hour hour and a half ish stream uh we're back in it uh because i finished writing a movie so it's fabulous but thanks for being here thanks to sky for modding and uh even though the you all are awesome so uh it's fabulous anywho um and sure, that sounds great. Let's go see Professor Melko. That sounds good. Uh, yeah, it was good to see all of you again. Uh, let me pull it up. Yeah, all the virtual high five. Uh, let me see. Oh, Eric's online. Let's go see him. Professor Melko wasn't coming up for me, but the UI on this streaming interface is not ideal. So I apologize ahead of time. Um, it may just be a bunch of us who are up there.